Hotep family, this is uh, Jareel. Um, I'm just going to just say it like this. I, I'm not here to play Mr. Nice Guy. The word nice means to be a fool. I'm not here to expect no one to believe me because believing is lying. I have nothing to hide. I have no shame in me. Therefore, I speak my mind. If you don't like what I have to say, just call the like button on Facebook that you can easily click to unlike me. I am not here once again. I am not here to convert nobody. Con Christians convert. I don't convert. I lighten the mind. That is why I'm here. I'm tired of all you coming to me complaining about this and that. I'm tired of all you coming to me complaining about Jesus, this and that, about what I believe and all this other garbage. What you need to do is you need to put aside the Bible, that fairy tale book, and yet yeah, you hearing it right from my face, that fairy tale book, pick up something else like your mind and go seek other things. Because of Christianity, because of any form of religion here on this planet, why has the world have not changed yet? Hmm, that's a good damn question, ain't it? Why has not the whole planet changed just yet? It's supposed to be this loving thing that you're supposed to be hoping and waiting for to come from the skies, like a Peter Pan heaven kind of crap. See, I again, once again, I love my mother. And I'm going to be straight up with you. I love my mother. She gave me birth. But I'm not here to take her word and take her belief in anything. She knows of this. She knows that when I speak, I mean what I say. But at the same time, I'm not here to, I'm not here going to disrespect my own mother. But I'm just speaking truth here. That's not disrespect, disrespecting my mother. That is truly not disrespecting her. It's something that I had to go do for myself. I love me. I'm in love with me because I know me inside and out. So there's no one here on this planet can tell me that, hey, you're a sinner. That's bullshit. Yeah, you heard it right from my mouth. Bullshit. And if you don't trust it, then unlike me. <laughs> That is not my loss. That's my gain. Because I'm here to shake your mind. See, I'm the nigga. I'm the nigga that came down here to the universe, from the universe, down here to this planet to wake your lame ass up. Now, if you don't like it, you know we can do with it. Now, for those folks out there who are really digging in and doing their best to know what's real and what's not, then Ashe, family, Ashe, you beautiful sons and daughters out there, do what you must do. Seek the knowledge that's deep down inside you. There's no time for us to sit down here and have some kind of fairy tale, you know, discussion about I'm an Israelite. Or I'm a Christian, or I'm a Buddhist, or I'm a Catholic, or anything else like that. There's no time for that. That's hearsay crap. Who you are is what you are inside. So for them to tell you who you are on the outside, that lets you know who are they on the inside. They have no knowledge of you. So who are they to tell you who are on the outside when they don't even know who you are on the inside? That's how lost these little lost little pigs and swines and dogs are around here. Yiping, <coughs> snorking just like that after they get them a good taste of bacon. But see, I'm the one that came down here. I am the sun. I am the S-U-N that came from the universe. I am down here to make me some bacon. My heat is too hot for you all. And that is why you complaining, crying, and whining just like a pig. So stop the nonsense. Stop it. It's time for you to let the belief go. Stop pretending of who you are. That is not you. 
Yeah, just got to wake up and smell the coffee. That's right, coffee is black. You got to smell the blackness. And I am not ashamed to say that. See, you have to realize, real eyes, real eyes, that right there, your penile gland, right in the middle of your head, that penile gland that you haven't used for a long, long time, you have to realize with those real eye to see exactly who you are and the deceptions that have been put over your eye. Call the Bible, call the Buddha, whatever you want to call it. So stop playing around and start finding out who you are instead of accepting someone else that looks on the outside of you because of your actions and tells you something that you're really not. If he's only or if she or he is only looking on you on the outside, then you tell them, who are who am I on the inside? If they can't give you no answer, then go on with them. But if they do give you answer, seek it out for yourself. Just don't accept what anyone has to say. Yeah, that's right. Don't accept anything they have to say. At least go out and give yourself some respect by seeking it. You see, I love those folks out there. I love my brothers and sisters out there. That is why I'm not afraid to come to your face and let you know the facts here. So peace, people. Hotep. Much love to you all, sons and daughters out there, you beautiful sons. Let the sun rise, so that way when it does, you can burn these little pigs to bacon. That way they'll understand where you're coming from. Ah, shit.